listening to the recap with the Goodfellas show. We back in the building talking that talk. Come on! It's your boy Tommy Guns alongside my man Shot Montana. What's good? You already know I'm over here booming at the rib. Did he say booming at the rib? What? Rib. <laughs> yeah, you got you gotta redo that one. I didn't know what he I think he said I'm booming at the rib, but I didn't know what that meant. I'm about to pause him. Yeah. <laughs> I have one of those fancy uh Minnesota Vikings jokes to say, though. Yeah. Ah, nah, we good. We good. Uh, <laughs> and of course, Dad Noble himself represent as always. What up? What's good, everybody? How y'all feeling out there? Thanks for tuning in to the recap. One more week, man. Y'all know what it is today, man. It's one gotta go day. And we uh-huh. talking about liquor. Oh, yeah. Right on. Special shout out to Big A and Karev. Yeah, they couldn't be in the building for this episode. They're off doing Goodfellas things. They will be back next episode. And of course, as always, the super producer, Beyond Mayhem Media's own Sage and Tyler, doing what he does behind the boards. So with all the introductions out the way, it's one gotta go time. Come on! Real self-explanatory. This is one of our favorite segments of the show. And you know, based off of social media, I'm sure, like I said, if you got Facebook or Instagram, you roughly know how this is gonna go. We give you four different selections. It could be anything, music, anything, movies, chicks, liquor, whatever, whatever it is. We give you four possible selections, all popping in their own right, and one gotta go. A little self-explanatory. So Dav Noble, the, what's this week's one gotta go? Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, sir. Thank you. So, you know, I had to I had to comb through the archives a bit. I had to come up with something that I'm not really sure if we've done before because we're talking liquor today, man. Oh. I don't know what y'all got Red today, but I'm sipping a little bit of McAllen, courtesy of Tommy Guns himself. Oh. You know what I mean? Um, so today's one's got to go. Like I said, we're dealing with liquor. So, all right, here we go. One's got to go. Tequila, mm. vodka, whiskey, or bourbon. Shaw Montana. One's got to go. Who you picking? And Wait, why? you said tequila? Tequila, vodka, whiskey, or whiskey, bourbon? vodka, bourbon. Mm. They initially had rum on there, but I, I, I don't know. Rum is yeah. tricky. I mean, honestly, whiskey and bourbon can go. I don't care. But I really want. You gotta pick one. <laughs> Either one, pick one. Whiskey, okay. bourbon, like. Uh, H- Hennessy is what? It's whiskey, or it's, it's bourbon. Cognac. Oh, oh, okay. All right. Cognac. Is that all right? So then let's throw cognac in there instead of bourbon. Come on. <laughs> yeah, we gotta, we got we gotta make it a little more challenging. Word. I know we gotta make it more challenging. You got rid of two, so let's throw that. But he still says whiskey. So what about so that? So which ones about... are still in the running? All right. For you, we got we got we got to change it up a bit. So you got tequila, you got vodka, you got whiskey, and you got cognac. Uh, whiskey. Okay. Uh. Okay. All right. That's not bad. That's crazy. That's what I'm drinking right now. Mm. All right. <laughs> Tommy Guns. Question Let's posed to see. you. One's got to go. This, you can this is a you lot more rich. challenging now. <laughs> let me see. Um, damn. Well, like I said, let, let, let's let's start with uh, cognac. Hennessy. I mean, that's pretty much the go-to for half of our lives. Oh, <laughs> like at some yeah. point, like, yeah, man. Yo, anybody who don't drink henny, you know somebody who drink henny. So it's <laughs> oh, hard to get rid of that one. Word. Vodka. Wait a minute. You can't get rid of vodka, yo. I mean, especially, especially uh, as I get older, I can't drink as much dark liquor. So it's all about the light. And vodka, I feel like it's no matter. There's there's enough brands, whether it's uh, Grey Goose or Tito's, or you can't get rid of vodka. You know what I'm saying? You can get rid of Russia, but you can't get rid of vodka. <laughs> you know what I mean? So vodka's got to stay. That's just a staple of any degenerates uh, liquor cabinet. Now, this is where it gets tricky. Now, I, I, I'm a I'm a fan of whiskey. Wh- whiskey would be uh, Jack Daniels, right? Am I am I correct? Yeah, I believe so, yeah. Okay. 
Oh man, I fucks with Jack Daniels. Yo. The, the Jack Daniels <laughs> honey. Oh, yes, man. That is that's arguably one of my favorite drinks. Uh, but but uh, I feel like whiskey uh. is more like a connoisseur type of drink. You know, you don't just you know that that's for people who drink drink. So that's not on the same level as cognac or vodka. Now this is where it gets tricky because tequila for a long time I wasn't really a big fan of tequila at all and I feel like it wasn't popularized in just pop culture like it is now I think recently whether it was um, uh, Casamigos Casamigos is tequila right yeah yeah. there's there's a few others that have been coming out too so over the last couple years tequila kind of you know unless you went to Mexico or you know you was in that area you probably wasn't drinking tequila but it's gotten a lot more popular last couple years and like casamigos is probably like my new shit so with all that out the way one's gotta go i gotta go with tequila but just because wow yo yo, got the bomb on that one steve yeah yeah. only only because that honey jack i can't agree with that honey jack like jack daniels is my shit like i i can't do it so yeah like i, I feel like tequila is probably the more exotic drink you know what i mean if you with the, the shorties or you on vacation you might go with tequila but if one of them had to go i ain't getting rid of my my, my jack daniels i'm sorry all right that's not bad so See, what about that was you guys was good yeah to be honest this is actually not that hard for me since i oh. since we changed it for shop because Really, to me, cognac is my least favorite of all of those because I am not. A, yeah, I'm not really a big Hennessy person. I feel I don't feel like ending up in the back of a of a paddy wagon at the end of the night uh, or a squad car for some strange reason. Um, I know Shaw was big into Duce. Not my not my favorite, but I know he oh, was no. big into that. That was never big. You know what oh, I what? forgot about Duce. Yo, 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 yes, you were. Yo, used to bring it to every yo. yo Shaw, you used to show up with Duce like at least two or three times the stuff that we've gathered to, especially movies. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What oh, I feel like Duce was like a swagger jacket from Hetty. Exactly. But Duce was was Jay Z's thing, wasn't it? Yeah, exactly. but only because it was Jay Z. Like, I don't think anybody actually liked it, but the branding. Shaw used there. to buy. Yo, Shaw used to buy Duce. It you, was not Duce. Me- it had to be Hennessy. Nah, bro, you used to buy Duce, yo. You Shit, I remember the E and J. I remember the E and J days. Yeah, like, yeah see, let's not days, let's not act like you know. What I mean, in our younger day, like yo, yo, uh, that's Kanye the point. usually that's the point. <laughs> led up to no that's, good, no good, no point. good happened from that. So it's like, listen, tequila. I can sip. You know, I yeah. like Terramana. That's the Rocks brand. Really, really good. The Casamigos yeah. yeah, at the at the at the uh, wedding. That's dope. You know, vodka, I don't really drink much, but you know what I mean? You can mix it. It's a mixer for me. You know what I mean? So uh, that's that's why I always keep that there. Whiskey, love it. Sip it, you know mm. what I mean? A little cigar, you know what I mean? It's it's yeah. it's good. The only thing I just can't in this, <laughs> in this uh, stage of my life, I can't seem to find a spot for it is Cognac and the consequences that come along with this. <laughs> cognac nah. chased with consequences. Which yo, everybody <laughs> laughs when I say Hennessy makes you want to fight people, yo. Like, no, yeah. no, nobody believes me. So, yeah. it's up to me, yo. I gotta, I gotta kick Hennessy out. I gotta kick the uh, uh. the cognac out. But that's not bad. That's no, you drink, you drink to kill it, though, right? Yeah, I do. Yeah. I mean, listen, I don't drink that much as it is now, yeah. but. If I if I do, there's certain my certain go tos are all either tequila, vodka, or vodka or whiskey. It's none of that is, you know what I mean, is a cognac. Okay. So even though I I have had Cavassier before, and it's you know it's pretty good, but I yo, I forgot I all about it. that, yo. Yeah, I still I still gotta for me that that's gotta go. So mm. we gonna wrap that one up. Wrap that that particular one's gotta go up with one okay. tequila, which I'm surprised about. I'm surprised you went with tequila, to be honest. But And then Sha, he went with whiskey, which I'm also surprised about. Whiskey is mad versatile. I don't know. I feel like the older- Whiskey's I like get, that grown man. Yeah, word, word. Like, you know what I mean? I just, I just feel like there's a, 
extra like I don't know sophistication that comes along with you know what I mean like yeah, yeah. the whiskey is but like that's the thing of anything but sophisticated yeah I mean it's like yo you feel like you like earned that drink if y'all show up and it's like yo we hanging out we going to Caroline's tonight to maybe see a comedy show and someone's like yo I got some McAllen it's like cool that's what's up if someone shows up and it's like yo we going out to NY to chill tonight I got this henny. I'm be like, yo, y'all not trying to come home tonight. Y'all trying to get up to the bar. Yeah. 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 Well, like, I mean, henny I'm is like, the official like, drink of all ghouls across the world. Yeah, yeah, like to me, you might as well, if you're gonna show up with henny, you might as well show up with four loco and just make it a crazy night. Let's just, <laughs> just, just go, let's just go over the top while we at it. Just just go for it. Let's come on! Go for it. Yeah. yeah, so oh yeah, by, by the way, before we go any further, shout out to everybody tuned in right now. One's gotta go. We were talking liquor, and we want to hear from you. What do you feel about our choices? Are we wilding? Are there just some liquors you can't get rid of? Are there some liquors you would get rid of? We want to hear what you gotta say. So make sure you leave a comment on the video, make sure you like, subscribe, all of that good stuff. You know how we do.